and the metal belender. Yeah. When I get my no more up, we're doing this here, so. But at the same time, do this. Is your girl if you should know? How are you doing? In case if you are here for the first time, I am a blogger, content creator on YouTube. Thank you so much for tuning in. Let's get to the entertainment room. You are welcome. Who are stupid, senseless, and abomination. The report reaching us is that Bonner Boy is right now in Ghana this evening. The former ex bestie of Shata reported that, and he said that should anybody try to do anything funny around Bonner Boy, that that person will be in trouble. That was what the young man said. And a lot of people, online users, have been against. Uh, Shut up for all the tweets, all those things I've been saying about raping a woman and all that. As a role model, a lot of people are uh, looking up to that he's not supposed to you know, be doing that. And they are calling upon the lab that signed him in, that they should do something about it, that he should be sacked, he should be fired. You see, if it happens for real, you see how he has used his mouth to shatter his career. Sometimes we need to know how to talk, especially when... You are famous. So that's by the way. Let's see how it goes. We don't know whether uh, Bonner Boy is going to you know, fight him as they are there, but I don't think it's, it's possible. Everything Bonner Boy wrote, the people in charge of the managers and all that, they just deleted everything. With everything the Shatterman had been writing, they are all there. That is to show you that Bonner Boy is an international game. He's not a local champion. You know what I'm talking about. So that's how it is. To you. Nigerians are not taking our nothing. Nigerians are hustlers. They are brave people. They are warriors. They are good. They know business. They are doing business. And when they come to Ghana, they bring money with them. They show money. What's at the way the Bena boy is a unyame? A bit triaka if you know chop Bena boy money. But you see, when Bena boy fell in love with you, Shatawale, he believed in you. He trusted you as a brother. Ninja brother from uh, Ninja, we believe in Ghanaian brother. And what did you do? You pass him back, go chop in girlfriend. You, you betray the guy. You break the street code. The street code where you break him, you break him right there. Snitch. You were a snitch. Bitch. You snitch on your brother. At the end of the day, you are expecting, you are expecting that same brother to sit and dine with you. And eat, eat and dine with you on the same table. Knowing very well that, you see. It was not an easy thing today for uh, the Davido's baby mama, Sophia. Sophia came online to defend herself. A certain blogger blogged and said that Sophia fought Davido and the other ba baby mama. So the young lady, Sophia, one of Davido's baby mamas, she came online today to defend herself and she said this year, 2022, that she's not going to take shit from any blogger. That whatsoever you are writing about her, that we should be responsible. We should be held responsible. That whatever you are writing about her, whoever that is writing it must be held responsible. She said that she even went to Ghana because the daughter had been asking about the other sister that they've not seen in two years. So she she begged and begged for the tickets of the babies to be paid before they were allowed to go to Ghana. So sometimes, well, that is how it is. When you are famous, is the shit you'll always receive. Whether you like it or not, people will talk about you. So just listen to the video she made and what she said about it. If I don't speak for myself, because nobody's speaking for me, and if I don't speak for myself, she's going to grow up to see how her mother was bashed for no reason. And then she will ask me, why didn't I say anything about it? But you saw what they said, but you saw what they did. Why didn't you say anything about it? It's been six years of bashing me nonstop. Anybody that knows me knows I'm a very emotional person. So... You might see me shed a few tears. I'm fine. Don't worry about me. I'm just, I've just had enough. enough. That's just it. You know, even when I'm laughing, I shed tears. So it's not new. I'm just very upset. I've been nothing but gracious. I've been nothing but sweet. 
when I buy stuff for my do my daughter's sister, you guys bash me. When I show her love, you guys bash me. I don't get it anymore. What do you be? I'm so happy that you came around again to listen to my video. Thank you so much. I'm really grateful. I am Ify Shoes Blog, we are content creator, and I do a whole lot of other things. I'm into estate management. Yes, I sell properties. And uh, I'm a fashionista, I sell fashion clothes. Yeah, feel free to, you know, to ask me more questions about that. If you want to be among, if you want to buy something, we're probably here to sell. Thank you so much for watching. See you some other time, and don't always forget to to come around and watch these short videos I, I'm making. Thank you so much.